All right, hold on to your hats, folks, because we've got ourselves a real doozy of a Facebook post to tear apart today. Get ready to roll your eyes so far back in your head they might just get stuck there as we dissect this plea for financial assistance. So, according to our dear Facebook friend, they've been fighting since 2019 to get disability. Oh, the horror! With a laundry list of health issues like back problems and autoimmune diseases, you'd think they'd have no trouble getting approved, right? Wrong! Apparently, they've been put through the ringer by the big bad bureaucratic machine. Yeah, sure, Jan, but hold up a goddamn minute. Let's take a closer look at this sob story, shall we? Because last time I checked, just typing that you're disabled doesn't actually make you disabled. Newsflash, sweetheart. There are people out there who are actually disabled and in dire need of assistance. And here you are, crying wolf on Facebook like it's your goddamn job. But hey, why let a little thing like integrity get in the way of a good old-fashioned guilt trip, right? Cue the violins and the crocodile tears because our brave warrior has mustered up the courage to ask for help. How noble, how selfless, how utterly fucking ridiculous. And let's not forget the peace de resistance, the PayPal plea. Any amount will help, they say, with a hint of desperation that would make even the most seasoned con artist blush. But hey, at least they're offering up their PayPal handle like it's the golden ticket to the goddamn chocolate factory. So there you have it, folks. A Facebook post that's equal parts infuriating and laughable. But hey, if you've got a spare dollar burning a hole in your pocket, why not toss it their way? After all, who can resist the siren call of a good old-fashioned scam artist? Until next time, stay sceptical, my friends.